So I'm gonna be showing you guys two different warm-up drills that I like to do today. And what's so great about these is you can even do them at an indoor range. They don't require any movement. They don't require a long distance or anything like that. So these are gonna be great drills for indoor or outdoor use. I'm gonna be demoing them on my CERT training pistol and then I'm gonna have Corey live fire them for you. So the first drill we'll be doing is called the line drill or the X drill, whatever you wanna call it. Um, I typically use the line that's already on my target and then I just simply draw five X's fairly evenly spaced out on my target. And then your goal is going to be to move along the line and try to hit each X dead in the center. Now typically what you have is one a little bit high, one a little bit low, another high, another low, something like that, maybe a couple dead on. Um, but the goal is to try to stay pretty well within an inch of your line. And I'm gonna go ahead and demonstrate with my CERT training pistol. The next warm-up drill I like to do is something we call the one in the hole drill. And it's simply drawing about a quarter sized dot on your target anywhere you want. Fill it in a little bit. I'm going to go ahead and draw another one over here. The objective of this drill is to get each shot to go through the same hole. Now realistically, that's probably not going to happen, especially if you're new at this drill. But what you want is for your shots to be roughly in that quarter size circle. Now whether they're a little high or a little low, that's something you can tweak later and that's probably going to be your trigger control or side alignment sight picture. Um, but you really, really want your shots to be in a tight group. And this drill really focuses on your trigger control and your sight alignment sight picture. Something you definitely don't want to do with this drill is chase your shot. What I mean by chasing your shot is looking after you take each shot. Um, in that case, you're probably going to have shots going all around your circle and that's certainly not what you want. Um, if you really focus on your sights, then they're magically going to go into a smaller group. So with this drill, again, you wanna start about three yards. Once you feel confident at three yards, you can move to five, then to seven. Typically, again, don't move past seven yards. You're just really gonna frustrate yourself. So I'm gonna go ahead and demonstrate with my CERT training pistol. And after about 10 shots or so, go ahead and see how you did, and then you can move on and do it again. guys so I went ahead and had Corey live fire these drills because I am very pregnant at this point and the baby does not like me shooting. Um, he did a very good job and this is exactly what you want to see in both of these drills. Obviously each one of his shots here on the line drill hit an X which is perfect but even if it does go a little bit above or a little bit below right or left whatever it may be that's still going to be a pretty good shot you just want it in about an inch radius of the X there but very very good job in that one and then also on the one in the hole drill I can stick my marker straight through there um, all of his shots pretty well went through the same hole um, and they were definitely within that circle. So that's very, very good. Exactly what you want to see on both of these drills here. But like I said, you know, start at three yards, uh, move to five, move to seven after you get more confident. But don't frustrate yourself too much with them. 
So again, guys, those are just a couple of my favorite warm-up drills, something to really focus on those fundamentals such as trigger control, sight alignment, sight picture, and follow through. Another great thing about these drills is you can do them at an indoor range and an outdoor range, and you don't really have to have a lot of room to do it, three, five, seven yards, whatever it may be. So hopefully you guys like these drills and you'll take them home with you and practice them. And if you guys like this video, as always, please click the like button, share, favorite, and subscribe.